coming yet. The Last of Us Part Two cast, Uncharted cast, celebrating the 10-year anniversary. Whole lot more, too. But right now, I want to talk about a game that I'm very intrigued by, and that is Accounting Plus. William Pugh, you're from Crows, 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 and... Well, we all know Justin Roiland. You, uh, you know, you know why. Squanch Games, Squanch yes, Games, Squanch Games. So, Accounting <laughs> Plus, Accounting Plus. This is one that you guys announced just the other day. Uh, yeah. This is coming to PlayStation VR. It's coming actually next Tuesday, December nineteenth. That's right, yeah. in the U.S. Uh, December nineteenth. That's right. Pre-order now, right? A very today. ominous date. <laughs> Pre-order today. Today, buy now. December, buy December 19th. Yeah, pre-order so. now. I want to look more like you, but I don't think I did a good job <laughs> um, with my mic. I, now I look like uh, Gene. Gene, Gene, are you there, Gene? Um, you gotta buy it. Uh, yeah, December yeah. 19th. December 19th. Pre if you pre-order now, it's Get 15 percent off. Where's Very the nice. There, there it is. Very nice. 15 percent off. That's if you good. Order now you save a couple bucks. Yeah. So I know we've got some actually footage of Accounting Plus running on PlayStation VR. So I want to check that out. Yeah. And I want to get you gentlemen to tell us a little bit about what we're seeing because this one is really interesting. Yeah. So oh, accounting. You're, I guess we're accounting here. Is this? Now, so this is the test. Like okay. this is the yeah. test if you if you're even capable of accounting. Okay. So this is before the accounting even gets started. The test. You, got the, you got the yeah. new game button, but yeah, you've got to be smart enough to play Accounting Plus because Accounting Plus is for smart people yeah. who <laughs> are developed, able to appreciate the art, which is uh, Accounting Plus. Yeah. Very sophisticated field. I, it I is. know that. It is. It is. It's. A, it's. You know. I mean, it's how the world moves. Is through accounting. That's right. How the how the world turns. <laughs> and, um, and speaking of turning and rotating. Like the let's world does. Let's turn right on to our <laughs> next point, which is... No, whatever. I mean, you know, you can rotate. It's VR. It's like you rotate. Okay. Um, so uh, the newest feature in, in, in Accounting Plus is the place... Well, actually, it's the fact that the Continue headset has no gravity. We forgot, oh. to, we forgot to turn gravity on. If you throw your Continue headset away, you lose it forever. Uh, but if you... If, you know, we... we you oh, yeah. You start the game over, basically. Yeah. And when you start the game, you learn how to rotate, learn how to play, you get a trophy. And so is this like a, a mini game here where you're trying to like clean your desk? Like what's going on? Oh no, there's no there's, gameplay. There's to no it. game okay. here. It's there's just do stuff and this goof is, around. This is really, you know, s strange for me to see because I'm assuming this this cut 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 well whatever. I, no spoilers, right? Um, <laughs> so anyways, yeah, no, it's like, you know, this is your office and then you're going into the... Yeah, so in, in Accounting Plus, you go down levels of virtual reality. There's VR inside of VR inside oh, of VR. Oh, that's cool. That's yeah. cool. And so in every in every level, there's a headset and uh, you put that on. <laughs> and whoa, whoa, I don't know if we can, we can show that on Sony, on Sony TV. <laughs> Uh, please ignore that. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, so you go, you go down layers, and you meet a bunch of characters, and and we'd like to say that your presence makes their lives better, but uh, yeah, you're kind of unwanted. Yeah, tree guy here. He's, yeah, he's not he, he's not too thrilled to have you. This is actually the first moment in accounting where where you where you realize things have things have gone awry. <laughs> Th this is not what you were being prepped for. This is. You 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 went deeper, but not in the right direction. We're still accounting here. We're definitely accountants. Yeah, I mean you're still an accountant, but you're you're not in the accounting. You're not in the right software. You're <laughs> the the right the right the right path. You've you've something went wrong, and you do have guides that sort of are are, are trying to help you. trying to help you out um, throughout the course of the experience. Uh, but they you know they're doing their best from 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 a remote location to sort of. You know, they're, 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 it's like it's the equivalent of like trying to help your friend get to your house and, and you're on the phone with them and they're driving and you're on your iPhone. And you're like, no, no, no. So, so no, you have to go. You know, it's that sort of happening in the game. Um, that's what the that's what that phone You've is. Got bird TV in. Yeah, yeah there's the, bird uh, TV. Bird TV is great. If you take a minute to just watch some bird TV when you when you get the game, pre-order it now. But when, when you can when you, you can you can get your head inside the birdhouse and watch can. the kind of TV that birds want to watch. I mean yeah. that's just bizarre. I mean that's just bizarre. I'll say it. Yeah, but I mean, but it's it, but we did a lot of research on on birds. What uh, kind we of had TV several books. We for real, like Dom and every uh, the team. We we bought several books and we. We thought really hard and long about the kind of things birds would watch. So yeah, then this is the gang. There's a real rough, rough gang. I mean, real rough, yeah. rough and tumble 
type characters. They're all ho horrible, but in their own way. Yeah. You do you do uh, some naughty things to try to impress them, like maybe spray paint on a wall, maybe illegally download a movie. Yeah, I mean your your no. goal here in this part of the game, uh, which is way off the off the path here. You, you're really supposed to be doing accounting right yeah. now, but you, you something's gone wrong. <laughs> but your goal in this section of the game is to just join the gang. This is an initiation, and uh, you know, and you're there, you know, and they're talking to you, and it's it's. <laughs> you got Rich Fulcher. <laughs> yeah. Scene. Cassie Steele, Rich Fulcher. Uh, I think Vache's in here. My buddy yeah, Vache yeah. Panos. He's the voice of Slipper, Slippery Stair for all you. Oh Rudy yes, fans. oh yes. And then uh, we've got uh, I'm forgetting one person. Scott Chernoff, I think, is in here. Yeah. And Scott, you know him from I don't even know what. Screw you, Scott. From something. Um, Cassie Steele, of course, Degrassi, and many other things. She's fucking amazing. Oh, you, see now you're picking up the brick and they're getting a bit worse. Yeah, uh, they're not brick doesn't do anything that. really. It's, yeah. it's kind of just a waste of everybody's time. <laughs> um, but, it's, uh, it's bizarre, but I love it. And uh, I mean, I know you guys actually have spent a lot of time. You were talking about this on our panel earlier. But you spent a lot of time actually building this whole big area of the game that's going to actually be pretty tricky to find, actually. Yeah. Yeah, the zoo level. Yeah. I mean, you know, it's it's a big deal. It's like, I, and we've talked to a lot of devs. Not specifically about the zoo level because it's at the time it was top secret, but just would you the blanket question would you spend an exorbitant amount an exorbitant amount of time and resources on um, creating something that is so absolutely difficult to access within the game? They said no. Yeah. Everybody was like, no, that's stupid. And then, <laughs> but that's and where that, innovation comes from. Yeah. And yeah. That, no. But that's what made us want to do it because we were like, well, if no one else is doing it, then we'll be we'll be the people that do it. And what we we're hoping is that it just it like that there's you know it's like it's like um, the race to it's like chess. You got to make all the right moves, and yeah. then you get to the secret zoo level. Just yeah. just like chess, absolutely. Check. Yeah, and the Check. zoo level is, is there's <laughs> no pun there. crazy I was I was stuff <laughs> that we put resources and time we put into the zoo level. The clown is there, and the clown might be the most sophisticated, like... He's probably the most advanced character in the game yeah. in terms of, like, artificial intelligence. Yes, yes, yes. Like, uh, the clown, who you see, you see in the trailer briefly, um, he... He, well, actually, to bring it back here, see, I, if, if, if it zooms out a bit further, you can see on the door, it says uh, secret level, uh, and, and this player is trying to get in here. Yeah, this is a secret level, but right it's there. not, we've, we've, this is not, oh, there we go. this is not the, well, we're not going to say what this is, but this is, this is access to a secret level. One of the many, one of the, one of the three secret levels. Yeah, there's okay. three, there's three secret levels. Um, yeah, the, the, this this game is significantly uh, um, bloated compared to the original. If you played the original, you would have thought it's lean, mean, gets what it needs to say, says it, and then gets out. And we felt like nope, not that this we time. We want to add more fluff to that. More and fluff, more, more replayability, more forks in the road. Okay, I got to go back in and play it again yeah. because I didn't hear what that character was rambling about for 25 minutes. Mm -hmm. So. That kind of stuff was very important to us, yeah. Now, William, we know that you and Crows, Crows, Crows are sort of an established brand in, in game development, you know, Stanley Parable work and, and everything else you've worked on. But Justin, I mean, Squanch Games, new to the scene, the newcomer. Just the new kid on the block. That's right. Yeah. I mean, why VR? A bright why games? I mean, you, you have a hit show. You have one of the biggest shows out there. <laughs> so you're just like, ah, I'm just going to run a what game studio. Doing, why man? not? <laughs> I'll just fire that up for my spare time. What have what, I done? What, what's going on? What have I done to myself? Yeah. Um, I'm busy. Uh, no, but uh, I don't know, man. There's something about VR that I just, I, I, I was, I still am uh, uh, obsessed. I'm obsessed. VR. But even just, I know it's funny because that's led way to just being kind of interested in game development in general, which I, I've been a huge gamer my whole life. Um, incredibly, I mean, I would, I would spend, you know, 12 hours. Did I say this in the other thing? I don't know. I've been talking all day. But anyways, I'd spend like 12 hours playing a Dangerously game. Dangerously long periods of time playing yes, a game. Yes, yes. Yeah. And my whole life. And, um, and then, you know, VR came and it was just like I, I, ideas just started pouring out of me i filled all these sketchbooks this was that year this was the year when the vibe when before you, the it was the gdc 2015 i think it was when, when we met right it was, it was that was the year we met and um 
We did the Game Jam in 2016, though. Yes, in yeah, March. So it's March, yeah. yeah, so the next GDC. But in any case, that whole year leading up to that, when you and I got together, I was entrenched in VR. I was, like, doing full game design for all these games. And I don't, I'm not a game designer. I'm just, like, thinking about this new medium and what I have access to, what I know is coming out hardware-wise, how those can, how they work. I got, I got hardware early from certain companies and uh, was able to just keep the water wheel going. And I don't know, it was like insane. I, I haven't been that inspired with content and just creativity, I don't know, since I guess maybe Rick and Morty, like, like early Rick and Morty days. But, um, but yeah, it was it was insane. I it's, and I still have all these all these like I've stacks of sketchbooks filled with all this crap. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. You know, some of it some of it's antiquated. It's like oh well, now the technology's gotten better, and or we've figured we've solved some of these problems. You know, locomotion or whatever it might be. That I was you know because it was not just story characters and stuff, but it was also systems and mechanics and how do you how, how do you, you move in VR? Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's a huge question. And we've been actually checking out a lot of PlayStation VR games here on the stage. Yeah. all day long and. Every game kind of has its own, uh, you know, style. Sure. You know, straight up, just full motion. Yep. Teleporting. Yep. Kind of hybrid models using DualShock, using PlayStation Moves. I mean, it's just, it's all over the place. And that's one of the things I love about VR is yeah. it, it feels like the Wild West. Yeah. It reminds me of, uh, in some ways, of PC gaming way back in the day when it was really new and exciting. And everyone, it was just off the wall, right? There's no established convention. Yeah. Yet. I it, like that. Like, yeah. we're seeing, like... Just in like in in twenty years, like we'll have maybe figured out the perfect like locomotion system. And yeah. Like, but, uh, and like now uh, twenty thirty, I'd go Thir forty maybe. <laughs> maybe fifty. Four, fifty actually, years. If yeah. being we'll all be dead. Yeah. Actually, this and they'll happen. nail it. We'll be dead when we're all in our late nineties, we'll ho early hundreds. We'll, we'll, and they'll we'll, put we'll, the headset on our face, <laughs> and, and we'll go. Like, finally, they finally got it perfect. I mean, yeah. they say humans are living longer and longer. So I mean, so science. <laughs> I mean, why are we spending our time making VR? We should be pushing the life expectancy. We should be working on that. So we can get that. the better. We're not yeah. the right people for that, though. We no. would mess it up. We would actually decrease. <laughs> we <laughs> like it we up. were on that we, job. We we shouldn't be doctors. Yeah, we're, we're not. We're not the people for that. But but yeah, you know, for VR, we're the right people. <laughs> 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 I I agree. I can't wait to play Accounting Plus. And very quick, we got to go here in just a minute. Yeah. Um, December 19th. Yeah, December, December 19th. That's what you're going to ask. December 19th. And if they pre-order right now, 15% off. 15%. That was, that was what you were going to ask. It's a bargain. It's a bargain. Uh, <laughs> it is, really. It's so cheap. It's like, what? I spent, I spent like $60 on a game the other day. I was like, what am I doing? This game's only right well, now. It, but right ten. now, it's $10. That's like, I, I can't eat lunch for $10 anymore. It, ma it makes sense. And I yeah. shop at the cheapest lunch It would be dumb not places. to buy it, is, is what I would think. Where the ch lunch is cheapest. <laughs> is, what's the company that, where that's their slogan? Uh, where the lunch is cheapest. Cheap lunches. If, it does, if that's not your slogan, if you're a company, and I think that's a, I might have actually just made we that could, up. We could stop selling slogans. Reach out to me, and I'll, you can have that slogan. I, I just had my people trademark it, though, so you're going to have to buy it off of me. Where Gentlemen, your lunch is cheapest. Sorry. Gentlemen, so much fun. Always love talking with you guys. <laughs> a ton of fun. <laughs> yes. Uh, so that's Accounting Plus. That's coming to PlayStation VR next week. Stay tuned. we got a lot of great stuff coming up.